Postcards from Oxford Road. Every road is a story. And the days they pass, the nights they fall, like wounded birds around her feet. But it doesn't have to be this way, she thinks, discarding her marigold gloves, her bucket, her broom. There is life in her yet. She flies over Oxford Road, bone on shoulders of the young. Their youth, a Duracell battery, keeping her afloat. At the university, she makes a list of things left behind. Screaming kids, filthy dishes, unmade beds, skull back at her, voices bite, set up home in her ear. You are too old, too wife, too mother, to be a student once more. But there she sits in the library, a teenager drunk on words. The quiet eyes of the books watch her, years tick by. She looks up one day and sees herself in Whitworth Hall, proud, upright, in a black scholar's gown, her degree a crown on her salt pepper head. A doctor of philosophy, she may not rescue a life, but she has saved her soul. Postcards from Oxford Road, Whitworth Gallery and Park. A quiet afternoon, a summer's day, scrubbed clean of virus, the road gleams. A cabby driver, I turn the meter off and wait outside Whitworth Gallery and stare at the ochre rust bricks. Dare I? The door smiles wide open. I step inside. Paintings nod. Statues grin. Standardization and deviation. The headline scream. On the walls hang textiles of far off lands. Guns, machines, cartoons and craft binding the world in a tight embrace. Tears and blood built this space, but now there's only the soft footfall of men like me looking to belong. In the cafeteria, over tea and cake, I spot curly cues of clouds floating high. The park, crowded with trees, presses its nose to the wide paned glass windows. Sycamore, beach, plain and lime. The bowed heads full of flower and leaf will shelter me from storm and grief. This museum, this park, tell me I am home. Postcards from Oxford Road, the refuge restaurant at the Kimpton Clock Tower Hotel. We would like to build a road back to us. Press an ear to each other's chest. Hear the heartbeat go wild before it stops. We would like a table for two. Are you celebrating something? The waiter asks. He leads us to an alcove table, shy and dark. A menu card crowded with wine. The shimmer and smoke of mirrors plays tricks with our eyes. We sit down to eat. Like a caterpillar, you nibble at a lettuce leaf. I chew a bird's dead bone. The clink of glasses is a funeral bell. Afterwards, we walk to the end of our road. The milky stars blink above. Our shadows duck and dive like dancers aiming blows. <laughs>